Welcome back to Weekend House. My name is Gaurav. Naam to suna hoga. Now this is the best time of the year because this is the time when we can all step out and enjoy a nice sunny day. A lot of people stepped out with their pets to witness the second edition of the Dubai Pet Festival. Now this was a great day out with the family and had something for everyone. So there were a lot of dog shows happening, cat shows happening. There was a huge animal petting zone, a lot of competitions and demonstrations happening too. If you have missed it, well, we've got a sneak peek for you. Dubai Pet Festival is the currently the largest pet show in the Middle East. We started in 2013 and it's been improving. Today we have the uh, main ring we have the World Kennel Union Breed Championship. Only pedigree dogs who are of different breeds are judged by international judges who come from Europe. And then the other side, a fun competition called agility, dog agility competition, where you have hurdles where the dogs have to go through. Um, you can use with the owner's help and trained ones to go without leash. We have a cat show going on in the cat show tent, which is uh, judging cats of different breeds. There also you get titles of best in show, best female, best male, different cat kittens are being judged. We have the Abu Dhabi canine unit uh, performing demonstration about the security use of dogs. These are trained dogs, they come for all our shows. The idea of them doing this is to get familiar uh, to people, uh, to inform them that, you know, their dogs are working behind. Like you go to the airport and other things, there's checking going on behind with sniffing dogs. Also, they are used for helping people and they are friendly as well. So they are showing three faces of the police dogs in, in, in duty there. Um, I'm here at the show really is the main veterinary surgeon. Uh, I have two colleagues here as well and our role has been to check animals into the uh, into the showground to make sure they're fit and healthy and fully vaccinated. Um, we're also here in case of any emergencies that may occur. I've seen a few dogs that I've given advice about bad teeth, one dog that had a skin problem uh, and just general health advice for the clients and uh, it's been very successful, really really enjoyable.